Welcome to Easy Driver, the most reliable source of automotive information on YouTube. Please like, share, comment and subscribe. In this video, we'll explore some of the most promising new materials that are changing the way cars are made. Let's jump in. Challenges and Opportunities in Implementing Sustainable Materials As the automotive industry shifts towards a more sustainable future, one of the biggest hurdles it faces is the implementation of sustainable materials. While the benefits of using eco-friendly materials are clear, the challenges that come with them can be significant. In this section, we'll explore some of the key obstacles that manufacturers must overcome in order to make sustainable materials a mainstream reality. Cost and performance trade-offs One of the biggest challenges in using sustainable materials is finding a balance between cost and performance. Many eco-friendly materials are still more expensive than their traditional counterparts, which can make them difficult to justify from a cost perspective. At the same time, manufacturers can't afford to sacrifice performance in the name of sustainability. So, how can they strike a balance between the two? By investing in research and development to improve the performance of sustainable materials. By exploring new production methods that can reduce costs without compromising on quality. By considering the long-term benefits of sustainable materials, such as reduced waste and lower environmental impact. For example, some manufacturers are using recycled plastics to create new vehicle parts. Not only does this reduce waste, but it also helps to conserve natural resources and lower production costs. Supply Chain and Infrastructure Development Another significant challenge in implementing sustainable materials is the need for a robust supply chain and infrastructure. Many eco-friendly materials require specialized production facilities and transportation networks, which can be expensive to establish and maintain. So, how can manufacturers ensure a steady supply of sustainable materials? By partnering with suppliers who share their commitment to sustainability. By investing in new infrastructure, such as recycling facilities and renewable energy sources. By developing closed-loop production systems that minimize waste and maximize efficiency. For instance, some companies are using blockchain technology to track the origin and movement of sustainable materials throughout their supply chain. This helps to ensure that materials are sourced responsibly and transported efficiently. Regulatory Frameworks and Industry Standards Finally, regulatory frameworks and industry standards play a critical role in promoting the adoption of sustainable materials. Without clear guidelines and standards, manufacturers may be hesitant to invest in new materials and production methods. So, what can be done to encourage the widespread adoption of sustainable materials? Governments can establish clear regulations and incentives for the use of sustainable materials. Industry associations can develop standards and certifications for sustainable materials. Manufacturers can work together to share best practices and drive innovation in sustainable materials. For example, the European Union's end-of-life vehicle, ELV, directive sets strict targets for the recycling and reuse of vehicle parts. This has driven innovation in sustainable materials and encouraged manufacturers to adopt more environmentally friendly production methods. Future Directions and Innovations in Sustainable Automotive Materials As the automotive industry continues to evolve, it's clear that sustainable materials will play a vital role in shaping its future. With the rise of electric and autonomous vehicles, the need for innovative materials that are both environmentally friendly and high performance has never been greater. In this section, we'll explore the exciting opportunities and challenges presented by these emerging trends. Electric and Autonomous Vehicles Electric and autonomous vehicles are revolutionizing the way we think about transportation. But what does this mean for sustainable materials? On the one hand, electric vehicles, EVs, require large batteries, which can be made from materials like lithium, cobalt, and nickel. These materials can have significant environmental impacts, from mining to disposal. On the other hand, EVs also present opportunities for innovation, such as the development of more sustainable battery technologies. Take, for example, the use of solid-state batteries, which promise to be more efficient, safer, and more environmentally friendly than traditional lithium-ion batteries. 
or consider the potential for recycling EV batteries, which could help reduce waste and recover valuable materials. Autonomous vehicles, meanwhile, require advanced sensors and computing systems, which can be made from materials like silicon, aluminum, and copper. These materials have their own environmental impacts, but they also offer opportunities for innovation, such as the development of more energy-efficient computing systems. Some of the key challenges facing sustainable materials in electric and autonomous vehicles include reducing the environmental impacts of battery production and disposal. Developing more sustainable materials for advanced sensors and computing systems. Improving the recyclability of EV batteries and other components. Balancing performance and sustainability in the design of electric and autonomous vehicles. Circular economy and closed-loop production. The circular economy is an emerging trend that promises to revolutionize the way we think about production and consumption. In the context of sustainable automotive materials, the circular economy offers a powerful framework for reducing waste and promoting sustainability. Closed-loop production, in particular, is an exciting area of innovation, where materials are designed to be recycled and reused, reducing the need for virgin materials and minimizing waste. Imagine a world where old cars are not simply scrapped, but instead are carefully disassembled and their materials recovered and reused. This is the promise of closed-loop production, which could help reduce the environmental impacts of the automotive industry while also conserving valuable resources. Some of the key benefits of closed-loop production include reduced waste and pollution, conservation of valuable resources, lower production costs, Improved product design and performance. To achieve closed loop production, the automotive industry will need to adopt new design principles, materials, and manufacturing processes. This will require collaboration and innovation across the entire supply chain, from raw materials to end of life recycling. Some of the key challenges facing closed loop production include developing materials that can be easily recycled and reused. Designing products for disassembly and recycling. Creating closed-loop supply chains that can recover and reuse materials. Balancing the costs and benefits of closed-loop production. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe for more automotive information like this. Thank you for watching.